The YWCA, the oldest multicultural women's organization in the world, is taking on an age-old problem, racism. Tanner News Science' Regina Mobley has the story. Well, Lena, with a sense of urgency, the YWCA has launched a stand against racism. It's an intense 21-day effort to dismantle racism and discrimination. They can be defaced, toppled from pedestals, or hauled away in a thunderous roar. These are the symbols of racism, but what's difficult to remove? The instruments of racism. And then when we start to look at just what privilege looks like and what power looks like, that's that's really where where the, the, the hard work is. Nearly two years after the knee on neck murder of George Floyd and the days before the potential selection of the first black woman to the Supreme Court, the YWCA has launched its annual Stand Against Racism. This year, the theme is We Can't Wait, Equity and Justice Now. In 21 days, uh, citizens right here in Hampton Roads have an opportunity starting today to participate in a 21-day challenge, which really is about information and education. The stand against racism will address critical race theory, something the governor banned, but that doesn't even exist in public school curricula. Will you invite the governor to participate in these discussions? Absolutely. And as a matter of fact, this has been such a critical uh, moment in our history right here in the Commonwealth of Virginia, uh, where we have banned with another sister association in central Virginia, which is the Lynchburg area. And so uh, we, we are making this a more uh, uh, regional and statewide, if you will, approach. So to participate, you can host a forum or rally, create a TikTok video or host a lunch and learn to spread the word about how racism and oppression affect the community. An event for the entire state takes place Thursday, April 28th.